All right, so we're over here at State Park just outside of Lovelock, Nevada. And uh, this is a nice little place. Uh, there's a dam reservoir just right over here. So yeah, we're over here at the park. There's something fierce over in the bushes over here making noise. It's frogs or what? But some people got bears to contend with. I got ducks. Baby ducks. So yeah. Campgrounds are never never a dull moment. There's something going on all the time. Just here at my campsite, still dealing with the wildlife here in Nevada. Like I said, some people get bears, uh, some people get uh, mountain lions, panthers, whatever, squirrels. I uh, got a bunch of turkeys, so. Getting closer to Lake Tahoe and we're uh, going into the south shore here. Uh, a little tunnel action and uh, yeah you can see it's just a beautiful place only been here a couple times but uh, I'm looking forward to this uh, stay here uh, should be uh, doing a few nights around the lake so yeah hanging out here in Lake Tahoe on the south side and uh, it's jumping Monday night it's busy around here and uh, it's just it, there's people everywhere and you'd swear that you know it's already the holiday weekend but I suppose up here uh, there's a lot of action throughout the summer all right so we're over here at William Kent campground and uh, second night in Tahoe and it was pretty dramatic last night uh, I actually had a bear at the campground uh, or my campsite and uh, yeah, I went to grab my flashlight in the door after noticing a bear over in uh, the neighboring campsite. So I was already watching that bear when I went to get my flashlight. And when I turned it on and picked it up and started to pan out and look around, there was a bear. So I instantly moved back, so did the bear. I got in the van, closed the doors, and we shut it down for the night. So. Uh, tonight, um, not looking for that kind of excitement, although I wouldn't mind being in the van and seeing bears walking around out in the road or whatever, but nah, I don't need anything close by. So, yeah, I'm um, going to continue over to uh, towards uh, Sacramento area uh, over the next day or two, and hopefully going to get one more day here in Lake Tahoe. And uh, I'll just uh, zoom in here on a little action. So you can just see all the the great action here in Lake Tahoe. I mean, it's the the lake is just stunning. It's uh, really clear. At some points, it's really uh, blue and then green, and it's just got a lot of really pure looking colors to it. And yeah, you can definitely tell that people that live here are very fortunate, very lucky. So um, lucky enough to stop here on the way over to California and uh, looking for more fun and excitement up along the coast but for now Lake Tahoe is representing all right so we're over here at Yosemite Lakes and we're hanging out got uh, the van out gonna grill up some burgers so we're just chilling down by the lake gonna be hanging out here most of the afternoon so just outside of Yosemite about 30 miles so it's a nice little secluded spot you gotta actually have a, a key to get into the gate so we got local local connections here pulling us to spots like this so 